Hi, my name's Ashley Jessen from profilebooster.com.au and today what I wanna talk about is regularly reviewing your automated email campaigns. Now, what we've noticed over the last 12 months is the number of companies that put automated email campaigns maybe a year ago or maybe even when they first started a year, two years ago or someone else, a legacy email system that was set up, all these automated emails are going back in time. Now, with some companies that we've actually worked with, we've actually found that they're offering in their first follow-up email sequence products that they don't actually even offer anymore. Now this is obviously a big mistake for a number of reasons. So what you need to do and a very important thing is to regularly review your automated email sequences. What we recommend you do is at least put it in your calendar as a recurring calendar item every three months. Now in order to do this there's a couple of things you need to do. Obviously you need to keep on top of all the landing pages that you have, all the lead generation assets that you have and all the webinar funnels and all that type of thing and then what you want to do is have a list of those and then regularly review each of those automated email campaigns that come off the back of it. So you might have a landing page that goes to an ebook download for example. Say your 2017 trading guide or your, your best blog posts of 2016 for the 2017 year and so on. Uh, so you might have that but then you've got an automated set of emails that go off. So over the next 30 days you might have five, you might have five, six or seven different emails that shoot out to them. Now it is so important to review these emails because I cannot even begin to tell you how many companies have actually got stuff that they just did not even know existed. So review those because this is the most important thing. In the first 30 days, that's your highest closing point. You wanna make sure you've got your best material in there and often over the last six or 12 months or even the last three months, you've generated some new content that is not maybe not earth shattering or anything like that, but it's good enough to include in your email sequence. Another thing we find is that there might be analysts or different people that are promoted that you might want to remove from those email sequences and you might have new staff that you want to drop into those email sequences because of their skill set. So this particular video is all about reviewing your automated email so make sure you're doing that every three, at least six months. Every six months review those automated emails, get on top of it and make sure you're providing your content, the best content to the people on your list and those just joining it. So hopefully you find that quite helpful helpful and uh, useful. If you'd like more tips and strategies, head over to our blog if you like, or subscribe to this channel. We'd love to carry on the conversation. Thank you.